As you just saw, I went ahead and I've done the window. So now I've got the same level of tent all around the car. I'm actually away with the family today. All right, guys, there you go. Take a look at everything right now as it stands. They, they wanted to do with these. Guys, proper cowboy. Proper right. cowboy. Wow, no way. Yeah. No way, that's the first. What's going on? How are you guys? Right people, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another episode from Salvage Nation. In this episode, we're back on the super cheap BMW E93 build. I've got this guy in the background. He's never able to help me guys. He's always busy, but this is his car and we're gonna drag him out of it today and we're gonna get him on board. Hello, I'm recording. Can you allow the noise please? <laughs> See what I got apart with? Anyway. Today's episode, we're gonna just continue with the assembly on the E93. In the last episode, we got a lot done. We managed to fix the gearbox, we managed to fix the roof. Tell me what you think of that. It was an easy fix in the end, but you never know with these things, it could have been a lot worse. But we keep it moving. In this episode, it's all about assembly and I wanna get the front end assembled on this car. We're still in the market for a BMW E92 or E93 front M Sport bumper. So if any of you guys have got one, do get in touch. Give me a message on Instagram see if we can work something out. But after I changed the door in the last episode, a lot of you guys were in the comments saying about the glass and the car has got tinted glass, but the new window hasn't got tinted glass. So that's where we're gonna be starting. And also on the old door, there's a few important bits that I need to remove off of that before we chuck that out as well so that we can transfer that onto the new door. So that's where we're gonna be getting started. So I'm gonna stop talking. I'm gonna grab this guy. We're gonna go get started. I hope you enjoy. Let's go. Wow. get to work. normally meant to be that hard but it looks like someone has changed this door at some point during the life of this car and have put in the wrong if you look at the one at the back the one at the back came out quite easily but the one at the front is giving us a little bit of work but we got it out guys got into the comments and was telling me about the window I had to change out the window glass instead of paying to get this glass on the new door retinted I'm just gonna swap out this glass so I do watch my comments and I do listen but a more important thing that I needed to make sure I didn't throw away was this is the locking mechanism for the original door that came which will mean that I can use this key blade to get into the car if the battery ever dies so have a look that now works there's one of these on the replacement door but if I don't swap this out, then this key won't work with that. So that was key to make sure I got that out as well. And I just went ahead and removed this mirror because this mirror is good. So why chuck it away? So that's everything that I can salvage off of that door. Let's continue to get the headlights on the car.
All right guys, so whilst I was doing the window, have a look at that, it's come out really nice, the window's all done. Whilst I was doing that, Akil was just doing some body work on the front end. We've gone ahead and straightened out that fence as much as it will go. And I'm happy with that, that's all good. So the wing now should line up nice and pretty. Have a look at that. Front end, like I said, there's no damage there. Other side wing, no damage there. So we're gonna continue to just make sure that everything lines up nice and pretty. And then we're gonna be installing those headlights there. And then hopefully everything on the wiring end should work. There should be no issues with the wiring on the front end. And then we'll be testing the headlights to see what happens. So we're gonna continue with that and then I'll let you see. I don't know, I'll try to film as much of it so that you guys can see how it's all going. Alright guys, so the headlights are in, front end is coming together, I'll take my hand out of the way, tell me what you think of that so far. Like I said, the bonnet is open so that's why you can see the gap there. We're going to work a bit more on the gaps, but the front of the car is coming together nicely. We actually got this guy to do a bit of work. Huh? How does it feel to actually do some work? <laughs> As you just saw, I went ahead and I've done the window. So now I've got the same level of tent all around the car. Um, and that was something that was pointed out by you guys. So I want to say thank you for that because I didn't remember. Um, I went ahead and I fitted the new, well, the old locking mechanism so that I can use the key on the new door. Just in case the battery ever dies, if I sell the car or whatever, it's always important to make sure you swap over the locking mechanism. After that, I've gone ahead and I've fitted the front headlights and those work. And the front end of the car is coming together. Let me know what you think so far in the comments down below. And guys, if you're enjoying this kind of content, please, please stop, stop. Go down below, click like. I'd really appreciate it. And you'll be helping the channel in the process. And if you're watching this, 75% of my views come from people who are not subscribed. If you're watching this and you're not subscribed, guys, please click down below, smash the subscribe button and help Salvage Nation get on the map. Right, enough talking. Now that we've done everything that we can do externally, let's move on to the interior. The car is a mess and I need to replace this panel right here and also clean up the interior of the car. I'm gonna go get some gloves because there's signs that rats or mice or some sort of rodent was in the car. There's a lot of chewed up plastic bags and what's not. So I'm gonna go get some gloves, tidy up the interior, give it a nice little clean and then we'll see what else we can get into for the rest of this video. So guys, before we finish off that, check out what, what's going on Akil. This let's, is some... Let's see now, let's see now what that, that, that clever mind <laughs> they, they wanted to do with these guys cars. proper cowboy <laughs> proper right. cowboy first one oh my god have to, to do one little operation have a look so what do you that's that's silicone that they did <laughs> wow. easy easy so guys they've, they've closed it all up with silicone okay. wow no way yeah no, no way that's the first so they've put four <laughs> Guys, um, they have stuffed this white foil paper. What the hell? To pull it up, to top up, you know what I mean? So they filled a gap with foil paper. No way. That is what you call cowboy at its finest. That's straight from the Western, man. <laughs> oh my God. Wow, no way. Maybe they got any money more. Wow. Look, foil paper and body filler. Ah, 
what's the point? Just buy a new, just buy a new wing. But they don't need more and you can straight with these ones. <laughs> no way. Let me see. Hello. Aluminium paper. Guys, foil paper. Foil paper. No way. So what? Hold on, hold on. So all of that is just in, instead of straightening up the wing with a hammer. Because I can still see it's still dented in right there. Well, I mean, Wing, you can see the wing is never. No way. It's they no haven't even tried to straighten down. it. No, yeah, no, nothing. nothing, nothing, nothing. And they put foil paper. That's the first. That's the first. That's the first. Easy way. Come get your car. It's ready. No way. All right, guys. So I'm gonna leave Akil to sort out <laughs> this mess, and I'm gonna get started with sorting out the interior. Guys, there you go. Take a look at everything right now as it stands. Front end's coming together. We've got the lights on, front bumper's on, grills are on, bonnet is on, wing is on, door is on. We're gonna start some bodywork on the rear quarter panel. We're not gonna be replacing that. That should be easy to just knock out with a bit of bodywork, a bit of filler, a little bit of hard work, and that will be all good. Tell me what you think of that car right now. On the interior, I didn't replace this panel because as I was about to replace it, Akil reminded me that we got to spray the interior of this door, and it's gonna be easier when the panel is off and we'll just spray this all white once it comes to the bodywork time. But everything on the back has been cleaned. And it's cleaned up quite nice. The red is quite vibrant still. Everything's popping on the inside. Still need to order a new mirror. But yeah guys, there we have it. We've done a lot of work in this episode so far. But for now, I'm gonna pack up everything here because I know it's still early in the day, but I've got some graffiti artists coming down to do a little bit of painting. It's gonna be a bit of a special one. I'm gonna do a nice video and reveal it on the channel later on. But I've gotta go meet them, get busy. So I'm gonna catch you guys in the morning. Come to the end of the video in all my haste yesterday sorting out the mural and the wall and the painting i forgot to do an outro so we're just going to do an outro today i'm actually away with the family today gonna have a little bit of a break but i've got some nice videos to tie you guys over in the meantime and one of the videos is that sneak preview that i just showed you of the guys from one two graffiti coming in and doing me an amazing mural on the wall in the garage and trust me guys it looks amazing and i'm going to be dropping that video on sunday Another video from the Golf R is coming and another video from the BMW E93 is coming. So we've got a lot coming. So make sure that you're subscribed and make sure that your bells are on so you get a notification when I post these videos. I'm off to enjoy a cup of tea, enjoy some time with the family and I hope you guys enjoy your time as well. So like I always say, keep it moving and I'll see you in the next one. Guys, thank you for watching the video. Click here to see what YouTube thinks you should watch or click here to check out this playlist on one of my previous builds. And I'll catch you in the next one. We out.